Delia Lavi, a timeless figure in the entertainment industry, has left an enduring mark on audiences worldwide. Whether recalling the first time you witnessed her on screen or pondering the qualities that make her an everlasting symbol, there's an undeniable charm to her work that transcends eras. Now, we invite you to share your most cherished memories or personal experiences related to this classic Hollywood actor. Drop your stories and reflections in the comments below. As we delve into Delia Lavi's journey, be prepared for a roller coaster of funny, shocking, and even somber facts about her. Keep watching for more. Born on October 12, 1942, in Shave Zion, British Mandate of Palestine, Delia Lavi's early life unfolded amidst the turbulent historical events surrounding the establishment of the State of Israel. Growing up in this dynamic environment, she developed resilience and a deep appreciation for cultural diversity. Coming from a Jewish family, her childhood was shaped by the challenges and triumphs of her community in the post-World War II era. The family later moved to Israel, where she encountered the rich tapestry of Middle Eastern traditions that would influence her later artistic expressions. Lavi's interest in the performing arts emerged early, fueled by exposure to different cultures and family support. She displayed a natural talent for singing and acting, participating in local theatrical productions during her teenage years, marking the beginning of her journey into the world of entertainment. Her career trajectory took a significant turn when she won the Miss Israel Beauty Contest in 1960, opening doors to opportunities in modeling and acting. This early recognition served as a catalyst for future endeavors, propelling her onto the international stage. Her career in the film industry began with roles in European productions, gradually gaining momentum. Notable events in her early career include collaboration with renowned directors and actors contributing to her evolving artistic identity. The influences of her formative years, coupled with diverse experiences, played a pivotal role in shaping her approach to the craft. The blend of cultural roots, early exposure to performing arts, and international recognition set the stage for a career that spanned various genres and languages. In conclusion, Lavi's early life in a culturally rich and dynamic environment, coupled with family support and her inherent talent, laid the foundation for a remarkable career in the world of entertainment. The influences of her upbringing and the recognition she received early on set the stage for a multifaceted journey in the film industry. Delia Lavi, known for her contributions to the entertainment industry, faced financial challenges and other struggles throughout her life. Despite her achievements as an actress, financial instability became a recurrent issue. The unpredictable nature of the entertainment business with fluctuating roles and income contributed to her financial difficulties. In addition to financial constraints, she encountered personal struggles that further impacted her life. Balancing the demands of a career in the spotlight with personal challenges took a toll on her overall well-being. The constant scrutiny and pressure inherent in the entertainment industry added to the complexity of her experiences. Her journey reflects the harsh realities that many individuals in the public eye face, grappling with financial uncertainties and personal tribulations. Coping with the ebb and flow of fame while navigating personal challenges can be an arduous task. Despite these challenges, Delia's resilience and commitment to her craft remained steadfast. She continued to pursue her passion for acting, showcasing determination in the face of adversity. Her story serves as a reminder of the often unseen struggles that accompany a career in the entertainment industry. In conclusion, her life was marked by financial hardships and personal struggles emblematic of the challenges faced by many in the world of entertainment. The journey, while difficult, exemplifies resilience in the pursuit of one's passion despite the inherent uncertainties that come with it. Born in mandatory Palestine, Delia Lavi, the daughter of European Jewish parents Ruth and Ruben Lewenbach, had a noteworthy journey that began with ballet studies in Stockholm, Sweden. In 1955, she returned to Israel due to her father's passing. A pivotal encounter at her 10th birthday party left a lasting mark on her life when she met Kirk Douglas, who, a decade later, would collaborate with her in Vincent Minnelli's Two Weeks in Another Town. This collaboration earned her a Golden Globe for Most Promising Newcomer, a testament to her talent. Delia's early connection with Douglas, arranged during the filming of The Juggler, initiated her ballet studies. This fortuitous meeting set the stage for a career marked by notable achievements, showcasing her versatility in the world of cinema. Her journey from ballet in Israel to receiving accolades in Hollywood paints a vivid picture of determination and talent. 
Delia Lavi's story is one that transcends borders and resonates through her impactful contributions to the film industry. Re-emerging in the 1990s, Delia Lavi made a notable return to the screen, gracing German television with her presence. Following a career that spanned singing and TV appearances, she settled in Asheville, North Carolina, alongside her fourth husband, businessman Charles Gans. Her journey took a poignant turn as she breathed her last in Asheville, North Carolina. However, the final chapter of her story unfolded in Israel, where her funeral and interment were held. It was a fitting closure to a life that traversed borders and left an indelible mark on the film industry. From her early days in mandatory Palestine through the heights of Hollywood success to a quiet retirement in North Carolina, Delia Lavi's narrative is one of resilience and transition. Her contributions resonate not only in the glamour of Hollywood, but also in the quiet corners where her story found its conclusion. Following a decline in her film career, Delia Lavi successfully transitioned to singing in Germany under the guidance of record producer Jimmy Bowen. Discovered by Bowen, she achieved fame with hits like Oh, One Comps Du, Whilst Du Mit Mir Jane, and C'est Ça, La Vie. In the 1970s, she emerged as one of Germany's most popular singers, topping charts with tracks like Oh, One Comps Du and Whilst Du Mit Mir Jane. During this period, she became a prominent figure in the German music scene, solidifying her status as a leading vocalist. This singing career marked a distinct chapter in her artistic journey, garnering widespread acclaim and popularity. In personal matters, her second husband was the writer John Sullivan. The couple married in 1967, but their union ended in divorce in 1970. They shared one son, Reuven, born during their brief marriage. Navigating through the realms of film and music, Delia Lavi's life unfolded with intriguing transitions. From cinematic achievements to becoming a celebrated singer in Germany, her journey showcased remarkable versatility in the entertainment landscape. This multifaceted trajectory culminated in a lasting impact, leaving an enduring legacy that resonates beyond borders. Survived by husband Charles E. Gans, daughter Kathy Rothman, three sons, five grandchildren, and a sister, Delia Lavi's family reflects the depth of her personal connections. Beyond cinematic achievements, her legacy extends to the immediate family, leaving behind a significant impact on multiple generations. In the realm of music, she made her mark by recording German-language covers of notable songs, including Melanie's Look What They've Done to My Song, Ma, and Gordon Lightfoot's If You Could Read My Mind. Her ability to interpret and adapt international hits showcased versatility as an artist gaining recognition in the German music scene during the 1970s. A noteworthy coincidence unfolded in the timing of her passing. She departed just seven days before Casino Royale co-star Jeffrey Bailden, adding a poignant layer to the shared history of those involved in the iconic film. This convergence of events serves as a testament to the interconnectedness of lives within the film industry. As we delve into the varied facets of her life, from family connections to musical endeavors and the intriguing intersections of her cinematic journey, we gain a comprehensive understanding of the person behind the screen. In her departure, she leaves a rich tapestry of experiences that continues to resonate in the annals of history. Born as Delia Levenbuch, the actress adopted the stage name Lavi, meaning lion in Hebrew. Her journey encompassed diverse roles, transitioning from ballet studies in Sweden to a celebrated career in Hollywood. A pivotal encounter with Kirk Douglas paved the way for success in Vincent Minnelli's Two Weeks in Another Town, earning a Golden Globe for Most Promising Newcomer. Beyond the glitz of Hollywood, the career witnessed a resurgence in 1990s German television. In April 1987, she became a naturalized citizen of the United States. Personal life entwined with professional pursuits, as seen in her marriage to Peter Rittmaster, resulting in the birth of their son Alexander before their divorce in 1975. Her life unfolded with intriguing intersections, from ballet in Israel to Hollywood accolades, and later, a vibrant singing career in Germany. The ability to adapt international hits showcased versatility, leaving an impact on the German music scene during the 1970s. In quieter corners, she settled in Asheville, North Carolina, with husband Charles E. Gans, where her final chapter unfolded. Delia Lavi's legacy extends beyond the screen, with the family reflecting the depth of personal connections. Survived by husband Charles E. Gans, daughter Kathy Rothman, three sons, five grandchildren, and a sister, her impact resonates through multiple generations. 
A noteworthy coincidence surrounded her passing, occurring just seven days before Casino Royale co-star Jeffrey Bailden, emphasizing the interconnectedness of lives within the film industry. In essence, her narrative is one of resilience, transition, and enduring influence, leaving an imprint not only in Hollywood's glamour, but also in the personal connections and musical landscapes she traversed. Fluent in Hebrew, English, German, French, Italian, and Spanish, Delia Lavi's linguistic prowess reflected a remarkable aspect of her identity. This multilingual ability undoubtedly played a crucial role in her diverse career, allowing her to seamlessly navigate various cultural and linguistic landscapes. Her journey, characterized by a transition from ballet studies in Sweden to Hollywood accolades and later a vibrant singing career in Germany, showcased a versatility that extended beyond borders. Notably, collaborating with Kirk Douglas in Vincent Minnelli's Two Weeks in Another Town earned her a Golden Globe, marking a pivotal point in her career. In the 1990s, she made a significant return to the screen, gracing German television with her presence. Her singing career in Germany during the 1970s further solidified her status as a leading vocalist with hits like Oh, Juan Comps Du and Will Stu Mit Mir Jane. Topping Charts Her personal life intertwined with professional pursuits evident in her marriage to Peter Rittmaster, resulting in the birth of their son, Alexander. Settling in Asheville, North Carolina, with her fourth husband, Charles E. Gans, her final chapter unfolded in quieter corners. The legacy extends beyond the screen, surviving through her family, including husband Charles E. Gans, daughter Kathy Rothman, three sons, five grandchildren, and a sister. A noteworthy coincidence surrounded her passing, occurring just seven days before Casino Royale co-star Jeffrey Bailden, emphasizing the interconnectedness of lives within the film industry. In essence, the narrative is one of resilience, transition, and enduring influence, leaving an imprint not only in Hollywood's glamour, but also in the personal connections and linguistic landscapes traversed.